700 miles southwest of Tokyo is Camp Kashi. Here, members of the Japanese ground self-defense forces are trained as paratroopers by members of the United States 187th Parachute Maintenance Company. The training is a joint operation between the United States and Japanese governments. Among the United States instructors are career paratroopers with as many as two to three hundred jumps to their credit. Paratroops, the development of the last war, have added a new dimension to military science and tactics. With airborne forces operating in cooperation with regular infantry, the military commander may now strike at the enemy's rear by means of what soldiers call a vertical envelopment, a rain of men and weapons from the sky. Naturally, those who participate in such an operation require a high degree of skill and training. The first objective of a paratroop unit is usually an airfield or other spot suitable for glider and airplane landings, where additional infantrymen can be flown in and later cargo planes with reinforcing supplies and troops. There is more to it than learning to jump from an airplane. Troops dropped in this manner find themselves spread out over a large area. Part of their skill consists in their ability to reassemble speedily into organized fighting units. The Japanese soldier takes well to paratroop training, as indeed he does to nearly all his training. The rapid learning ability of the Japanese people is almost proverbial. The training period at Kashi, which we have here seen, lasted two weeks. Of the 96 students who started the course, 92 finished with honors. Those who failed did so only because of disablement due to minor injuries incurred early in the program. The man with wings, in whatever army, belongs to a proud fraternity.